What's up guys, Tobin here. And Shanna. From the 5M Family Homestead channel. I'm still here. I'm still kicking. She hasn't been on a video in a long time. It's Saturday morning, Saturday before Christmas. It's a brisk 58 degrees here in North Texas. <laughs> and we're going down to feed the chickens, let them out, and get eggs. Shanna's counting chickens. We're missing Coco. Excuse me, lady. <laughs> Was she laying an egg? That's right. Oh, there she comes. Mom's representing today. It's one of my favorite shirts. I stole it from you. They're very comfortable. They're very soft. Yeah. They're that Bella canvas, I think. Yeah. So I stole them. So, so if y'all don't know Adler Farms, they're a nice little channel, about the same size as us. Uh, they're in Missouri. Go check them out. Over in there. Come on. Skyler, watch out. I'm trying to get him to go in the garden so they can peck around. Come on. Skyler, come here. Come here. We've shown y'all in other videos, but our garden's pretty much done. We've had several pretty hard freezes, so but we've been letting the chickens in there, let them do a little cleanup. They're liking it. And then these knuckleheads can't figure out how to get in there. They need it too in theirs. <laughs> Look, Walker Farm Fam was talking around. Walker Farm Fam was saying that they were running low on their feed. And I guess maybe it's everybody because we're at low on ours too. We need to. Ooh, that needs to be cleaned out. I hate those feet. And I'm just gonna dump the rest of this on the ground. They make great eggs, but they're not the smartest. They're trying to get right there. And the gate's right there. Look, and then she went like. They've only been on this property for four years. Well, most of some of them. Skyler, come here. 
Come here. What are you doing? So guys, we're going to make a whole breakfast using cast iron skillets. Um, we making breakfast on Saturday mornings when we're home is a kind of a tradition at our house. So, and we normally make most of it in cast iron skillets, but I thought it'd be fun to make all of it. So we have three big cast iron skillets. One of the, the big ones Shanna got a few years ago, it's a Pioneer Woman one. But the other two, we've had them for, I don't even know where we got them, and I know, I know we've I had them for. I actually think we got them at a flea market. Okay. Years ago. Like in probably 20 years ago. Mm -hmm. So, but anyway, so we're gonna make biscuits and gravy, sausage. Uh, I'm gonna make me fried eggs because nobody else likes fried eggs, and I'll make uh, them um, scrambled. scrambled eggs. So, and we're using Cowboy Kent Rollins' uh, method to make scrambled eggs. If you haven't watched his channel, he has a ton of good cooking. Uh, Cooking video, they're all cooking videos and they're all good. He makes tons of stuff and uh, he's only got like 1.7 million subscribers or something. So, you'll go help him out and subscribe to him. Tell him we sent you. <laughs> so, let's get started. Looks real nice putting the biscuits in there. I do it now. Everybody in the family loves those. Yeah. They're frozen. And you can just pick one at a time. Yeah. If you just want so to make like one. if you want to make just one or two, you don't have to make a whole can, so they're really good. Guys, in this skillet right here, I'm gonna make the sausage. I'm gonna pull the sausage out, fry my eggs in there, pull those out, and make the gravy in there. And then that one, we'll be making the scrambled eggs in. For the scrambled eggs, about a teaspoon, tablespoon of whipping cream, and then of mayonnaise. This is Cowboy Kent Rollins recipe, and it comes out really good. So Reed's gonna help with the scrambled eggs. A little bit of butter in the bottom. Gonna let it melt. All right, guys. On this skillet, the sausage is done. I pulled it out and then kind of scraped it. This metal spatula right here is key for for, for uh, cast iron. It it slides across it really good. Pulled all the sausage out, kind of scraped the pan off, threw the little pieces in the trash, and now we're going to do some eggs. Now for the gravy. Shanna is a bit of a gravy snob and she says my gravy is the best gravy she's ever had. That's true. So 
I'll show you how to do it. It's vegetable oil. Guys, breakfast is served. I'm hungry, so. So you don't want to talk? No, I will talk. I'm just hungry. I'm starving. I woke up hungry. Yeah, so we got this morning, as y'all saw, went out and did some chores. Um, it's 10:15, and Easton is still asleep. No. No, he's not. Mm -hmm. It's 10:15, and Easton's he just not doesn't asleep. Come out of our... well, he hasn't even shown up. Reed's been here helping a little bit. Uh, we got up about eight this morning, did some chores outside around the house, and then we always make a breakfast if we're home. So. So we're gonna eat. I'm excited to eat breakfast. We haven't been home in weeks. We've been we home. haven't been, we've, we've been available yeah. to make breakfast in a couple weeks. So it's nice to have a good breakfast. Yeah. And we probably won't have to feed the kids. Cause it's so late. Feed them lunch? Yeah, feed them lunch. I should have said that. I mean, we will feed them, just not, not feed lunch. them lunch. Yeah. So we're gonna make our plates. Hope y'all enjoy the video. If y'all haven't already subscribed, we'll see y'all again. Bye. Elf. I'm gonna make mine and then go and try to see if I can find the one on HGTV. Something on there. Never have too much.